A young woman is dead after a dramatic shootout ended in a crash in the North Loop neighborhood of Minneapolis. Family members tell us that 18 year old Autumn Merrick was killed while riding a scooter. Police say the innocent woman was struck after people in two vehicles were driving and shooting at each other through downtown Minneapolis. One of those vehicles struck Merrick at the intersection of 5th and 6th Avenue in the North Loop near Target Field. The crime is the latest incident increasing the fear and uncertainty for those who live and work in the area. Here's Kate Raditz. This SUV, which was a big SUV, with the, the whole front end was smashed like you know, this building collapsed on it. it. It was unbelievable. John and his wife are visiting Minneapolis for a wedding. They were in their North Loop hotel room Wednesday night when they thought they heard fireworks. And then it wasn't until we saw, I saw smoke and then all the fire police and all of that. Police say at least four men were involved in a shootout between two vehicles that drove side by side in the 1800 block of Nicollet Avenue. They eventually made their way to this intersection near Target Field and collided. One of the vehicles struck a young woman. Family says she was 18 year old Autumn Merrick. A friend told us she was on her way to get a slushy Wednesday night. She died at the scene. I'm extremely concerned. I'm ex extremely concerned about the direction of the city. I have been for a while. Jay Ettinger owns the poor house in downtown Minneapolis. He says he thinks crime won't improve if voters don't make changes to the city council this November. Honestly, I think people will leave. I did speak to several people who live in the area that said they would not be renewing their lease or were considering moving because of the crime. We're standing right here where a woman was just killed last night. An innocent woman just living her life, just living life. Uh, and, and, and in an instant, she's gone. Guns were recovered from both vehicles at the scene that investigators were still cleaning up Thursday. People were going to work and walking their dogs. There were also several people who told us they like living here and think the good outweighs the bad. It's, it's like this in most places. Yeah, be careful. Like, it's um, try to take as many precautions as you can. Like, not every, every place is going to have its issues, right? Kate Braddett's WCCO 4 News. Police say they have identified four suspects that were taken to the hospital following the crash. They're still looking into whether more people may have been involved. Friends of 18-year-old Autumn Merrick tell us she loved to laugh and would lift the spirits of others when they were down. She was a joyful person. Like, every, everywhere she went, she brought light. Merrick was a recent high school graduate who had plans to move out of her mother's home and get her own place. Friends say Merrick was loved by many. We'll hear more from friends still trying to understand exactly how this happened. That's ahead on our news at 6.